Hey, what's up guys? So, um, Unreal Engine has just released version 4.14 and there's a lot, a lot of uh, new features uh, in this new version. So, one of the features is a uh, pre-computed lighting scenario and um, basically in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to use this new function and uh, how we can uh, enable this feature and we can store multiple scenarios uh, in our project you know uh, so for this particular tutorial I'm just going to show you how I can use it to store my day and night scenario and toggle between the two scenarios you know the two scenes basically and uh, so basically I have a, a normal uh, day scene that I, I created in my Archvis and um, when I press a button uh, on my keyboard it will toggle the night scene as you can see here so by using the pre-computed lighting scenario we can uh, do that very easily and I'm going to show you how today let's continue okay so let's get started so I already have a day and night scene created I'm just going to quickly show you um, so first of all I have a, a day scene Okay, uh, Okay. it's not fully built yet, it's just in preview building mode, later I'm going to build it fully and we, will, we should have a nicer uh, scene, but it's not fully built, uh, the light, so uh, I have a day scene and also have a night scene, okay, that I've already done up, okay, so both are pretty similar, just that uh, the geometries are the same um, but the materials are different so I have used a different background for my scene at night and that's pretty much it I don't really have a, a, a big difference between the two but the lighting is are different okay so I have removed the skylight I have uh, I've removed the directional light and I focus mainly on uh, spotlights for uh, my night scene and so this, the, the lighting is different so obviously the light maps will be different so I'm just going to show you this, these two scenes uh, um, and I'm going to combine these two scenes into one scene using the new feature so that we can toggle uh, the two scenes together I will be using a keyboard uh, to toggle a simple toggle blueprint system uh, of course you can build very nice UIs which I will not cover here so let's get uh, let's continue and uh, again these are in preview mode it's not fully built yet uh, so let's uh, let's go okay the first so the first step is to create an empty level so I will create a new level called uh, just an empty level okay and uh, uh, it's just to be a master level you know uh, to contain the two scenes that we have created let's go ahead and name it um, loft one master okay so okay once I save it I'm going to add my two scenes into the level so if you don't have uh, this uh, window um, basically what you do is you go to window levels okay and usually it comes uh, un untagged you know or unpinned so what I like to do is I, I usually pin it here oops yeah I pin it here so that uh, I can s manage my levels um, in this window uh, in this screen or whatever you call it okay so I already have an empty level and now I want to add my two levels my day scene and night scene into this level okay so I just go to levels uh, at existing which is my day heading levels and okay okay so it's here and I'm gonna add another one which is my night scene okay so just a few things to note when I add uh, so I've already add both my levels so um, just a few things to note I just want to make sure that um, because when we do level streaming we're also using this uh, so I just want to 
uh, highlight to you you have to remember to change the streaming mode to blueprint because we are toggling using a keyboard okay so both uh, using blueprint so the active one is usually the one highlighted in blue okay so usually uh, if you want to see the two scenes you just uh, uh, off the other one okay uh, so uh, and also make sure that uh, it is a lighting scenario so you, it can be a regular level or lighting scenario so we want it to be lighting scenario so this is the new feature in unreal engine 4.14 yeah so once you are done with that uh, which is very simple right uh, we want to rebuild our lights so that uh, so what what unreal engine is doing now is it will take these two levels you know compute all the lighting again and it's going to store it both the night and the day's uh, light maps onto the scene okay and by toggling using blueprint it will call out the day or the night scene you know so this is what uh, on, on a very high level what uh, unreal engine is doing in this okay so basically let's just uh, build proper now and uh, once it's, it's finished building uh, i'll come back again okay okay so my light has been fully rebuilt and so if you see it here when i off my night scene i will have a my day um, scenario and when i off my day scene and on my night scene i have my night scenario so now i just want to create a blueprint system to toggle between my day and night when i run uh, my project so let's continue so i'm going to make the persistent level the current one and i'm going to add a level blueprint okay so the first thing is when i start uh, my project when i press play i want it to load my day scene okay so i'm just going to use the event begin play and I look for load stream level yeah make it visible and uh, love one underscore day I'm gonna make it bigger for you to see okay so I'm just gonna have a load stream level make it visible and call the uh, love one underscore day level okay once that is done and press play it will load my day scene okay now so what i'm going to do now is i'm going to use the button m m for money uh, on the keyboard to toggle into the night scene okay um, so i'm gonna open up the blueprint level again level blue blue level blueprint okay i'm gonna put uh, n sorry n for night Okay, so when I press the end, I'm going to unload my day scene and I'm going to load my night scene. It's okay, so I'm going to put unload stream level day. I'm going to load my night scene. Okay, make visible. Love one underscore things capital N. Okay, and I'm gonna do the same for M to load back my day. Okay, I'm gonna unload my night scene. I'm gonna load my day scene. And make visible okay i'm going to compile and let's let's try it so then i'm going to press n for night and triggers my night scene i'm going to press back m for my day oh, okay so there's uh, some issues with the player start uh, so let's work on that right now Okay, so what I've added, done is uh, I've added a player start 
uh, object onto my map and uh, so now when I press play okay can move around and I'm gonna press N I can move around as well and I press M it toggle back so this is a quick and simple tool you can use uh, when you present to your customers on uh, if you have different uh, lighting scenarios that you want to present and you want to toggle quickly uh, you can use this uh, method and I, I think it's quite uh, useful so uh, I hope you enjoy and uh, please uh, subscribe and comment on our YouTube channel if you uh, if you have any questions uh, please feel free to ask thank you